<laughs> is Darren Betch, who's with us here. If I'd known, I'd have worn a tuxedo, uh, Ben, but I'm not sure that's fitting up for the weather. The weather is looking very quiet this week, in contrast to what we had last week. We're starting on a chilly note, but it will gradually get just a little bit warmer day on day. In that chilly air, we've seen some sunshine. We have recently seen a bit more of this cloud building up and spreading out a little bit. Good afternoon. It's not feeling quite as warm as yesterday, but we still have some sunshine. Just a veil of high cloud turning that sunshine hazy a little earlier. Well, it's not just the meerkat family uh, enjoying the weather. Look at this gorgeous mother uh, or father and baby bird. I think it's a mum. Uh, our weather is not looking too bad uh, this week. It's largely fine. We could get the odd shower here or there, perhaps a high chance on Thursday. In the sunshine, it's nice and warm, obviously colder uh, under the cloud. We have beware gardeners still got some chilly nights to come if you've just put all your crops out uh, pay attention to that Still so our pollen levels are moderate over the next few days. Good news, I guess, for the hay fever sufferers. Mostly oak pollen, but also a bit of grass pollen as well. That's it from me and my gorgeous little friend here. I'll see you later on. Cheerio. Good evening to you. What a decent start to the week. Plenty of sunshine around, albeit quite a chilly start. Our weather watchers have been out and about taking photographs. A gorgeous one here of Ready Money Cove in Foy in Cornwall. And we'll hold on to the sunshine as we move through the week. A lot of dry weather around generally. And what you will notice, it'll start to warm up a little bit too, so nights won't be quite as chilly. Hey, Samantha, but we did have quite a lot of sunshine around today. But if you were up early enough, yes, there was some rain bit earlier on this morning, just for the early rises really, that was a cold front coming through, introducing some showery outbreaks of rain and of course much colder feeling air for today than we saw yesterday. So the temperatures didn't get very high, in fact they were below the seasonal average, most of us 15, 16 degrees. We did see a 17 at Heathrow Airport, but there was quite a bit of sunshine around today with more cloud gathering into the afternoon and a couple of very light showers, but for most of us it was dry. Now there will be a slow improvement in the temperatures as we head through the rest of the week. There's also going to be quite a bit of sunshine and it's looking mostly dry with high pressure dominating so it's quite good news for me really as we head through the rest of the week. And we've just had the hottest day of the year. We have actually, but there have been some changes. So we thought yesterday was the hottest day of the year so far. But a late entry from a weather station in Devon now means that Saturday was the warmest day of the year so far with a daytime high of 22.6 degrees Celsius at Virginstow in Devon. Such Sunday though was pretty warm as well but slightly cooler but this is what we thought was our warmest day of the year 21.6 and that was uh, at Helens Bay in Northern Ireland and also at Kew Gardens in London as well uh, and it's all well looking Fairly fine as we head through the next few days, in fact, for much of this week. This was the scene at Blaze Castle earlier today in Bristol. And it kind of paints a picture for this week. Broken cloud, sunny as balsam, some relatively uh, warm temperatures. Although today we saw a high of 18.1 uh, degrees Celsius and that was at Cardiff. But things have been a little on the cool side as we've gone through much of spring. So we're around halfway through May. So let's take a little look back actually. So temperatures have been 0 0.5 degrees Celsius uh, below average for the time of year. Rainfall has been near normal. But as you may have guessed, it has been pretty dull for much of spring. In fact, we're at 65% of average. Well, as we head through the course of this week, as I say, it is going to be relatively settled. The emphasis is on some pretty dry weather over the next few days. However, there will be a few bits of patchy rain here and there, particularly up towards the northwest. And also some chilly nights to come, despite us being in the middle part of May. So that's where it's looking this Monday. As I say, a fairly fine week to come with high pressure mostly in control. OK, that sounds good. We won't hold it to you, but keep perfect. Fingers crossed, Alex. <laughs> Fingers Thank you crossed. very much.